morning. Any kids here today? Does that mean I don't have to do this? Well, <laughs> we could be young at heart. I'm sure we can get something from it. All right. I've got an object lesson today. Can anybody tell me what this is? A flashlight. Very good. What does a flashlight do, Paul? <laughs> it shines. <laughs> well, let's see if this one works. Nope. Am I doing something wrong? I'm pushing the button. It's not working, is it? All right. So I guess we better check it out and see what's inside. Empty. I just left them out. <laughs> okay, so we're working now. All right, so we are like this flashlight. We are God's light to the world, right? Well, yes. what if our batteries are missing or dead or we forgot them, left them out? Um, or try to do the batteries on our own, okay? So, um, what I'd like to, to make a point of this morning is God gives us the opportunity, like today, to recharge our batteries. As we gather with each other and we pray for God to work through our lives, our flashlight shines, doesn't it? But if we try to do it on our own and don't seek the Lord's face to, um, for him to work through our lives, then the light's not, it's going to be pretty dim or non-existent. So when you pick up a flashlight to, to use when you're in the dark, uh, just remember that God wants to help us shine his light to the world so that everybody can know him and that he can show his love to them. Let's pray. Dear God, please help us to receive your light so we can shine with your love and care and be your parade of light for those around us. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Diane, for that lesson. And thank you for going forward. We don't know uh, who all is watching live stream. We might have some child up out there. Um, but we all can be young at heart. Uh, and I honestly received from that message as well. 